All right, guys, I'm back at the storage unit. I am going to do a little filming today. I'm going to try to find some hidden treasures that I haven't seen in here yet. I definitely want to find this Nintendo Switch if it's in here. I've got the box, so that's a clue that maybe, just maybe, that's a TV that's wrapped up. All that's got remotes and uh, hopefully maybe the gaming systems are in there. You can see that dresser there. That's money. There's a media center there. That's money. Underneath that is something else. That's going to be money. More furniture over there. That's going to be money. I'm hoping one of those is like a wine cabinet because we've got like a whole wine cabinet full of wine and vodka and stuff like that. Alrighty, guys. This looks to be a legit hoard here. This coach purse. These are all coach purses. Now, if these are all real, this will pay for the unit. Um, but this one. There's that. There's the tag. And... If we can get it to show up here. Come on. All right. $378. That... Let's look at the stitching on this thing. Ah, you know what? This might actually be real, folks. We'll have to get this looked at. But this lot here could pay for the unit. Here's Coach New York. It's got a bag from the place. It's got a mini mouse stick. Oh my god. Uh let's see if I can take it out of here and make it look better. But wait a minute, here's the tag. $375 for this. Why is these pictures not showing up better? Okay, this is pathetic. Must be the lighting in here, but this oh lord, there's a bag. Another bag down in there. But uh, that might be a legit coach bag. All of them might be. Here's more. The smaller ones. Now this one's clearly used, but I gotta go look through that one. Uh, this one. is from coach. Ooh, these could be really good, folks. This looks legit. Minute, let's do a better job, Mark. Come on. Get your... I don't think this has been used. No, it's still got everything. There's like... There's three. Uh-oh. This could be really good. Look at this one. That's a Mickey Mouse. Is that coach? Take that card out of there. Oh yeah, that's brand new. That's brand new. Look at that. This this is probably cost what the unit did. This coach bag. That's three fifty. Comparable value. I am QBX. What do you think? These look kind of look legit. I got my eBay guy. We'll definitely want to see these because I think there's some real money here. And yeah, New York. Yeah, I mean it's just probably a good lot here. Uh oh, there's something good down there. Another one. Here's another one. Oh, good Lord, Mark. You can do better than this. That's Coach. Looks like blue denim. There we go. Look at that. It's real leather, you can tell. And let's get it out of here. Get more light. Oh, 
Look at that. New York. Coach. Another bag. Probably another. So, retail of these is way more than I paid for the unit. So I don't know what we can do with these, but uh, we're going to get a lot of money for them or a lot of gold scraps because I, I barter. Uh, this is a great store right here. And it's good that I found these because a lot of the stuff I found it isn't great, but then I'll open up a box and it's full of good stuff. So let's see what's in this. Cards. Uh, Players Club, Cadoba, Phantom Fireworks, Kentucky Kingdom, no gift cards yet. I might just leave this for her to have back. These are expired. Malibu Jacks, rechargeable game card. Gotta make sure there's no money in it. All right, I'm gonna take this load down. I want to show you a few more things I pulled out of here. You know, we've got five cats and got some big ones, so we may decide just to keep this pet carrier. We've got one, but it it is smaller, and this gives them more freedom. If we don't keep that, then we'll sell it. We'll get a good price, and we got a brand new Oster blender, never taken out of the box. That's good. A new easy bake oven. That's not actually shoes, that's mascara and stuff like that. Brand new box of Swiffers. Uh, my wife, look, that's usage profit. And uh, there's still more. There's this TV's wrapped up, there's the base, all the controls and everything. There's another TV somewhere else. Yeah, there's a TV there. There's a nice uh, lazy boy lounge chair with cup holders and like a love seat mattress box springs i'll probably donate the mattress and box springs uh but yeah and then there's some stuff i haven't gotten into yet furniture below that and there's four good pieces five good pieces six seven pieces of furniture for probably five six hundred bucks so that'll probably end up being profit and we're starting this lady out because she got screwed out of this unit. She actually made a half a payment and that and they promised they would call her before they sold it and let her uh, get the chance to cure the account. Well, they didn't do that. It wasn't really my fault, but I was the one that bought the unit. And uh, I was willing to sell it back if they would, you know, pay me. I, I was going to ask double for what I paid for the unit to give it back to her. But then they said, well, since she only made a partial payment, we're not legally obligated to give it back to her. So, while they were legally protected, uh, you, can, you can question the ethics of it, but uh, I'm not here to judge. I'm just here to buy storage units. And uh, sometimes those things, they, they happen. It was an opportunity too, you know, for. But I digress. All right. And we got this really nice scooter down here. I don't know what powers it yet. Maybe there's a power pack. Maybe it doesn't need one. I don't know yet. Open this box. We got a couple of new pair of shoes and a comforter. And this one's not very exciting. New perfume. Glam. Just like a travel bag here that was in there. No real valuables in there got a sellable here I know this is just low dollar stuff but you know we got this has not been touched here that's 
something. Okay, and then this one was just full of There's more shoes in a bag here. Tons of school supplies, which I'm going to be giving to my grandkids. Got plenty of it. Two USB matching lamps. And, uh, you know, like some bubble mailers. So, so far, these two I'm taking today. Just very little, little value, but that's okay. We're looking for treasure. All right, guys, in this box, I just uncovered a Adidas backpack in really good shape. Like, it's hardly been used. This Coach backpack, Macy's bought at 400 and... Why can't I see these things? My camera's always picked up this kind of stuff. Uh, but it says 450. Must be the lighting in here. Now, we know we're not going to get that, but that's brand new. It's a Woodstock Coach backpack. And brand new uh, microfiber sheets. And something new here in the box. Sweet Candy, Ariana Grande. Yeah, that's not going to be Jack. But, just this one. Probably at least another $100. So, we keep looking. A lot of the stuff in here is, guys, it looks kind of like this. Where I'm opening it up, there's just like medications, vitamins. Now, here's some new costume jewelry. All stacked up in a bag. Don't, it doesn't look expensive, but hey, it exists, right? Um, that's a key to her heart. And just random stuff. Okay. Just things. And there's money. <laughs> But in the coach purchase, we found a nice, nice, nice score today. That's not real. So, really, this one, I'm not going to stop and show you a lot of this stuff. Just kind of an overview, because this is these boxes I'm taking are like this. Now, the furniture in there. And see, she bought at this coach store. She got it at Macy's. Okay, can you buy legit coach stuff at Macy's? If that's the case, then I believe we've got a crap ton of dollars in coach purses here. There could be more. It's kind of like what I say about gold when I'm finding it. When you find gold, you know what? There could be more. Stay tuned to the channel every Monday, 7 p.m. Videos coming out. Much appreciated, guys.